guys, Shrank Zebra 166 here, and uh, this is a Slumber Tycoon 2. So I had, um, I was just going through all of, uh, just looking at some of my older videos, and I had come across um, a comment on one of my earlier videos about the um, the height um, for the gold bridge to get it exactly um, exactly at the, the right level as mine is now it lines up perfectly with the edge once the doors go down you can yeah, it's a flat flat entrance to the um, swamp <coughs> swamp ledge over there so I thought I'd do a little tutorial on it and I'll uh, give you the exact um, measurements you can see that tree there still trying to drop There's just so much lag from my base but anyway so what I've done is I've placed uh, the blueprint um, the smooth wall this one right here and it has given given um, the height. It's not quite. It's not quite there, but it, it's the actual height that the door has to be when it's um, turned over. So the bridge exactly. This will give you the exact height of the door itself that has to when it's when it's folded down and opened to be. So um, we'll get into it, and I've already put them up here. So I'm going to just show you guys how to get that exact level. And uh, we'll just count these as we go up. So from ground level, we've got one, two, three, and I'll have to go on the other side. We've got three to there, number four, and this number five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17. 17 exactly to there. And the top of this is, uh, well, with this piece here, is the same height that you want your door to be when it's opened. And as you can see over here, it is that uh, half a unit higher. Or lower than this this top of this height. So I'm just gonna try and climb up here a bit and try and jump my way onto that pad. I'm not sure if I'll make it, but I might. So, will I make it? Yes. You can see the lag. The lag that my base gives. It's terrible. That's probably one of the other reasons why I don't really play that much anymore. Um. Okay, so when we open this, this height that the store is at, so you can see how it's, you know, it's just that wee bit, just a wee bit sunken in, a wee bit higher, a tile size higher than the floor. And uh, as you get over here, just quickly run out here, and you'll see how how perfect it is. Uh, 
and I'll, um, I'll show you how to hopefully get it at that height. So it comes in here, it's, it's the, the level's like right there at the, the right level. I mean, you can only see the doorknobs down here. So that's, yeah, that's flat and that's perfect height. So I'll show you how to get the level and um, you'll be able to do it on your own then. And it'll be the exact height that you uh, that you want. And this this isn't the way that I I originally got the level. I did it uh, with a, a laser and and I just sort of zoomed out and had to sort of judge it with the floor height and make sure it sort of looked at eye level and that's how I did it and it was actually bang on but this way as you can see this this sits on top of the 17th um, wall piece up for your height and it does sit if I just zoom out here and go like this you can see how much higher it is so the door when it's folded over should be at this height but in order to get that this is what you do <coughs> so once you've built up so high and you've just started a bit of a platform at this height this is this is what you do guys you get um, another blueprint and you go for a, a tile the large tile could be this tile and that should the tile should roughly be at about that height and you may need to you know you may need to do two of them I'll try and just get this to sit at the same height but this is what I what I usually do in order to build it up to that right height or drop it down to the right height this is what I did I used uh, tiles see they're either going to sit at the bottom height or at the top height so if you put them at the bottom height there and put say two of them on top of each other that should give you your, your right height for this and what you do then is you get another one once you fill them in you probably only need three or four of them you bring this up grab another one and you put it on the edge so it's hanging over the edge and then once you place that down It's the same height, you see. It's exactly, roughly, about the same height they actually need for your floor. So it's it's only you know it's very minimal. It wouldn't make much of a difference at the other end. And then you start lining up your floors at that height. So you could do it that way. There's other ways to do it. If you went off the top of this, you could come down uh, cuz even that there like that, you know, it's it's minimal. It's like probably 2 or 3 mil minimal. But that's how you how I got the height. So I'll go back over to this side. I don't need that there anymore. Because that won't do anything for me. So 
So you got 17 of these high over here, going up the ladder, so you know how high they are. In fact, you could probably just put a tile on top of that. But even doing it this way, and then put your tiles underneath. Um, same thing. So you got your tiles, and you put them underneath there. One. Okay, so that's that's at that height. Another one underneath that, and that almost lines up perfect there. Two tiles underneath there, and then same with the third one. Have it hanging over. And then you place a floor on top of this and that'll give you your height. So I've got a floor right here. Um, I'll just, just move this and see if it is roughly about the same height and that's how you can do it. Yeah, it probably won't want to sit on there. because it is a, an actual filled in floor. So that's, yeah, that's, that's minimal guys. Yeah, so you got those blocks. You put, uh, go two tiles down and then put another third one off the end and build on top of it and that'll be your height. So yeah, you want to get it about halfway in between, in between this one here. So 17 up, put your one on top and you want to get it about halfway through that. And the only way to do that is to adjust it with tiles. I don't know if that's that's clear to you guys or not, but um, that's the way I would do it, and that'll give you the best. Um, best way to get that uh, right height there. Okay, so I'll just show you that again. So you built up um, if I've got a bit of wood up here, I'll just fill it in. But I don't have a piece of wood there. Okay. Okay, so we've gone up 17. We've got our height for this. And I'm going to get our blueprints out. I'll just use the tile. You could even just, just do it right beside it, I suppose, to get your, your height. But, uh, oh, yeah, it's going to allow you to put it underneath. So, even if you put it underneath. tiles underneath of it. This is easier. And then you put your floor. 
put your floor underneath that. Hopefully it'll let me place that up there. Like that. Perfect. And that went backwards to what I wanted it to do. But you can you can do that. And once you've placed your floor your, your first floor there, you destroy these. See that gap? That's the gap you want there. And you build on top of this floor. So you can start placing your floors on top of it and it should be almost the same level as this. Look at that. It's not much higher. I would be happy with that. <coughs> and then that's your initial floor. And it gives you your, your exact height. That would work perfect. And there you have it, guys. That's the easiest way to do it. So you start off with the 17 up. That'll give you your height. Start off with putting one of these on top, and then you get a tile. place two tiles underneath and place one large floor and then start building on top of that floor and that'll give you your height for your um, gold bridge so I hope that helps people out just how high the uh, gold bridge is roughly and um, that's that's yeah that's perfect perfect height and then you put your door up like this over here and uh, when it folds down that'll give you the exact because when the, the doors fold down they uh, sit a wee bit higher like that and that'll give you a exact should be very very close match over there okay guys um, thanks for watching and uh, I hope this helps a lot of people that want to get that height and I find that this was the easiest way to sort of try and tell you how high it was so it's 17 of these here which is which is in your walls it's the smooth wall but it's the uh, the one on the end here 17 high okay guys thanks for watching you have a good day bye